ought to get to know the man. It is he, Jehovah, that created mankind. It is he that made the heaven and the earth and even hell. It was he, Jehovah. So the scripture says, he maketh me to lie down. Yeah. When everybody else is on the verge of losing their mind. Yeah, yeah. And in spite of all the hell you're dealing with, when you put your confidence and your trust yeah. in the He, yeah. He got a way of calming you down. Yeah. He got a way of lifting those heavy burdens. Yeah. Anybody ever tried to sleep and couldn't sleep? God got a way. Yeah. You don't have to have no sleeping pills. God got a way. Yeah. The scripture says that he maketh me to lie down. Notice where he says, where you're going to lie down at. He says in green. Example of what I'm saying, dead grass is a bad place to lay down. God said, I'm not going to let you lay down in dead places. But the place I'm going to let you lay down in is called green. Yeah. 
God's mind. My soul, he, he leads me in the path of righteousness. Oh, for his name's sake. I don't care where I go. His name is the one that opened up the door. Uh -huh. Where they go out. Walk through the valley of the shadow of death. Move it, God. Move it. I will not fear yes, no evil. Yeah. Yeah. Now notice he didn't say, I'll lead you through the valley of death. Uh -huh. no. But he said, the shadow Come on, now. of death. I don't mean to scare nobody in here. But everywhere you go, you got a shot. Yes, sir. And everywhere you go, death yes. is on your trail. Yes. Yes. Yeah. You all know what it means by the valley or the shadow of death. See. I used to see without glasses, but now I got to put my glasses on. I'm just going through the valley of the shadow. My hair, when I had it once, was jet black. Every now and then, I let it grow, it got a little green in there. It's just the shadow of death. Somebody ought to be able to be a witness head that once you stood straight up. But if you live a long time, your back will go to bending from the burden of many years. It's because you're walking through the valley of the shadow of death. When you can't remember like you once could remember. You're looking for your glasses and they're sitting on your nose. That means you're walking through the valley of the shadow of death. But uh, know what the writer said the Lord will do. Said, uh, yeah, no, you won't. Uh, through the valley of uh, the shadows of death, you'll fear no evil. Yes. And uh, for thou art with me, and uh, thy rod uh, and thy staff, uh, they comfort me. And uh, which signifies uh, that uh, even in the valley, uh, why, uh, I may get scared along the way, yeah, but uh, the Bible said uh, that uh, the Lord will be with me, and uh, he got a rod, uh, and uh, he got a staff uh, that uh, will comfort me. Yeah, yeah. Although death is all around me, why, uh, he told me I don't have to worry, uh, about facing death because uh, his rod and his staff uh, is going to come for me. And uh, notice what he said uh, in verse number five uh, why uh, he prepared uh, a table uh, before me uh, in the presence of my enemies. That would try to destroy me. Everybody that was trying to make me feel worse than what I'm already feeling. Everybody that was trying to make your life chaotic, trying to make your life real miserable. Why, uh, God said, uh, Don't worry about your enemy.
in his nostril. Uh, yeah, and the sheep would take his nose uh, uh, and scrape it against the ground. Uh, the sheep would take his nose uh, and run into a gate or a fence uh, uh, to try to relieve him uh, of all the flies uh, that is in his nose. Uh, and while he was doing that, uh, uh, he started bumping his head. Uh, uh, he started scratching his head. Uh, and in the midst of all of that, uh, he wouldn't kiss him. Uh,
Christ Church. Out of the office of safety. Yeah, yeah. This is your chance, your privilege, your opportunity to come and give your life to Jesus Christ. Yeah.